What's up, you? What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. This is Hassan Shabazz. Gonna get ready to go on a little walk. Before I do some running today, also. First, I'm gonna loosen up a little bit. You should always, if you're gonna run, make sure you loosen up. Don't just make sure, make sure you stretch, 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 stretch good. Sorry. Cause you don't want to pull a muscle. You don't want to hurt yourself. So make sure you stretch. Make sure you drink enough water. Make sure you're hydrated. Make sure you're well stretched. So we're gonna get ready to take the little work, make the take the little walk, and then we're gonna run. Probably walk a mile and run run, run about two miles. But um, before I go. If you first time stopping by the channel, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, share the video, look at other videos on the channel. We have many videos dealing with health, so feel free to check them all out. We'll be back at the end of the video uh, with some tidbits on some health related things and also some just life related things. So, um, we're gonna warm up a little bit. Then we're gonna go for a walk, and we're gonna do for, go for a little short run. The benefits of stretching. The right stretching have the power to remake your workout, your health, and your life. Think that's exaggerating? Think again. Stretching has super awesome benefits. And, so, and you should prioritize stretching before you begin your exercise routine. Whether it's an aerobic exercise routine or an anaerobic exercise routine. Make sure you get your proper stretching in. If the first mile of every run feels like straight up torture, you need to start warming up with dynamic stretches like leg winds, high knees, and body weight squats and lunges. You need to improve your posture. Improve your posture comes down to more than willing yourself to sit up straight. Tight muscles are synonymous with weak muscles, which lead to postural compensation. And this is coming from Dr. Jacqueline Brennan, a personal trainer and co-founder of Mindful Wellness, which is a Chicago-based company that teaches on-site fitness classes and wellness workshops. So we give credit to um, the source. Be sure to stretch your core, your neck and shoulders daily. Stress and ease back pain. Because your back pain may, be, may come from a tight hamstring. Says so clinical exercise physiologist Tara Romeo. Assistant director of the Professional Athletic Performance Center in New York. So you need to ease your back pain by stretching. Make sure you Get, you stretch your hamstring properly before you exercise. Stretch also improves exercise form because tight muscles don't do anything good for your exercise form. Stretching also prevents injury. One of the main benefits of stretching is the decreased risk of in injuries. Performing dynamic stretching in particular, prior, in particular prior to exercise is important for preventing any of those something snap injuries. And those normally occur with, when you exercise with cold, tight muscles. Also, stretching properly boosts your joint health. It also slightens stress. And stress reduces reduces blood flow resulting we know that stress reduces reduces blood flow resulting in muscle tension knots. 
but stretching increases the blood flow to your muscles and it eases tension and it helps you feel more relaxed. Stretching helps you to sleep better. What do you sleep? What do you sleep? Five or eight hours daily. Then in one position for a length of time may cause you to feel stiff. Static stretching before going to bed will help relieve some tightness or cramping that you may feel during the night. Stretching improves your performance at work. If you take uh, have stretch, do stretching when you're on break, that'll help. Stretching helps you to, to relieve stress. Help the blood to flow properly. Also, stretching is stretching muscles. And last but not least, it increases flexibility. And flexibility is needed when you're working out, especially when you're when you're doing squats. When you're moving about, it's good to be flexible. So stretching increases flexibility. So make sure you get a good stretch in, leave a five minute stretch before you jog, before you run, even before you walk, make sure you stretch. This has been Hassan Shabazz, Sacred Life Connection Health and Wellness. Hope you're having a fantastic time. Hope life is doing you well. Hope you're eating right, praying right, sleeping right, and living right. So until next time, hope you have all the success you can have. Peace. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to Hit that notification button so you won't miss the video. Don't forget to share. And don't and above all, don't forget to like this video. So peace. We are.